is up my crazy subscriber, this is Joking Johnson the and today I wanted to give you guys 5 good reasons why we should hate Black Ops 3 but hold on guys, I hold on, do not take all your torches, do not take all your knives or whatever you, ha you have in your pockets to attack me, you know, hold on, chill the hell out. Um, I will be doing also top 5 good reasons why we should get Black Ops 3, so I will be doing the both sides of the story, so if you guys want to hate me after this, then go ahead. I already told you guys I was going to do both sides of the story. Um, reason number 1 we should hate you know, Black Ops 3 is because nobody asked for this Halo bullshit. Seriously, we're going to have another Halo game going on, or Destiny, or whatever you want to compare this game to. It's literally Titanfall. It is literally Titanfall. So... We got ourselves another Halo bullshit. Nobody asked for this shit. You know, World at War 2 would have been great. And I'm telling you, a lot of old school gamers would have returned at this point. They're going to be like, I would have seen Mr. Glock. I would have seen Fisticuffs. I would have seen El Presador come back into Call of Duty and tell us that, yeah, you know, this is what exactly what we wanted. And we're coming out of retirement. A lot of YouTubers would have actually come back into Call of Duty. Because I know most of you guys have are subscribed to certain YouTubers that started off with Call of Duty. And they're not doing it anymore. It's because, hey. We all wanted that old school feeling. Moving on to the next reason. Jetpacks. Who the hell asked for these? Seriously. Like, why do we have jetpacks again in Black Ops 3? Nobody wanted these. Everybody hashtag no exosuit and yet we got it. And I know a lot of you guys are going to be saying, well, it's not exosuit. It's called freaking jetpacks. And instead of, you know, exos jumping or whatever, you know, it's thrust jumps. Thrust jumps, hump jumps. I don't give a damn jumps. You know, I just want to stay on the floor. Nobody asked for these super you know freaking mechanical parts jetpack or whatever it's going to be called you know nobody wanted that stuff i didn't want it myself uh moving on to the next reason david vonderhart lied to you guys what <laughs> where are the fanboys from these people like like a lot of people seriously want to deep throw vonderhart i've been saying this for the past months and i'm right and you can literally see every time david vonderhart posts up something a lot of people defend the dude like he did something good like he's the next notch or some bullshit like hell nah man he said if he wanted to play like black ops 2 we're gonna be doing the same thing in black ops 3 you know it was trying to tell us like black ops 3 was gonna be exacting that's black ops 2 and then it never happened after watching the trailer I, I was pretty you know i was on point i told you guys he was gonna lie to you and he did and yet everybody still defends him so fuck von der Haar. he lied to us and we thought it was gonna be another black ops team uh moving on to the next reason uh dlc maps i'm pretty sure i'm pretty sure these are gonna be the worst dlc maps of all time let me tell you guys why back in black ops 2 if you guys got the dlc maps you actually bought the same dlc map at least six times let me tell you this, guys. I've been saying this over the past two years, and yet nobody has picked up on it. I, I, I can't believe it. White Boy Samus Street or Woody's Gamer Tag or whoever's doing Call of Duty out there has not noticed that the DLC maps are repeated. They are repeated. I don't care how much they reskin it. They're the same pathways. There's going to be three pathways, and one outside pathway will be connected to the center pathway. Go back. Go back to Black Ops 2 and tell me I'm wrong. Because I know what I saw. Look at through your uh, through your DLC maps and tell me I'm wrong because I'm right. I am fucking right. I'm telling you, those maps were repeated, but they were reskinned, and sometimes the middle path will be over or under, connected to the uh, to the uh, one outside path. It was the exact same thing. So a lot of you guys were paid for the DLC maps because they were repeated. They were literally repeated, like six of them were. So out of the out of the ten there that were in the whole game. Uh, next reason now the title black ops 3 you know it's pretty much okay the thing is i don't believe it needs to be next to call of duty anymore it's another halo bullshit like i said before and um well can't believe it they're still naming it call of duty might as well just get rid of it you know just get, just get the hell a, a rid of it you know just just no no man just get it away from call of duty it's not call of duty anymore just call it titanfall 2 or uh call of titanfall or something because that's what it is that's what black ops 3 is it is titanfall i haven't played titanfall i know that you guys are gonna be like oh you haven't played it that's why you you know i don't give a damn i know what i'm saying and i'm always right and yet people are denying People are living in denial nowadays. I don't know why. I keep on saying the correct things and they pretend like they're they hearing shit. Like, come on, man. Y'all full of shit in your brains or something. Y'all gotta listen that this game sometimes is doing the wrong thing. It is not always gonna be right. I used to be a fanboy of Call of Duty. 
I would defend this game with my, all my guts back in Black Ops 1. And then I started seeing some, you know, bad things about it. And I was like, all right, this is a not good, but I'll still defend it. And this was like during Modern Warfare 3. And then when it came down to Black Ops 2, I was like, fuck this game. Because around May, I know they updated all, every single weapon out there. And that made all the SMGs weak. And all the weapons were weak, except for the snipers, which became like pretty much a quick scoping game. So um, that is it, guys. Those are some of my top reasons. You know, Vondahar, DLC maps. Black Ops 3 itself, the Halo style, we wanted another World at War. Or a Black Ops 3 that looks exactly like Black Ops 2. Because I would like to play that shit in next gen. But with more, you know, different weapons and, and uh, kill streaks and stuff. You know, the perk system also. Um, so that's it, guys. You guys agree with me, disagree with me? Let me know in the comment section. See you guys later and subscribe for more Call of Duty content.